Good day, YouTube. We are uh, in the step van, my mobile studio we're building. We've got some uh, perfectly uh, legal, non-copyrighted music going. Doing a little experiment. Um, it's a little more than an experiment. I invested quite a little bit in uh, the wireless microphone world. And I have a little something to share. Uh, others have tried this, and uh, maybe it's working pretty good for them, and it's working pretty good for me. This is uh, something I've been thinking about doing for a long time. So, a little bit of background. Um, I have a mobile DJ business. I do a lot of big outside car shows and so forth. And to do that successfully, I have remote speakers. I have a speaker tower. You see my build of a speaker tower. Uh, on my YouTube channel, um, but I need the ability to send the audio signal to uh, remote amplifiers uh, for long distances, a block or two or three or a mile or whatever. Sometimes I do big inside events where I want to send signal across a room or into another room wirelessly and pick it up with another amplifier and broadcast um, you know, one source or audio or actor or musician or music, um, front of house and back of house and even in other rooms. So I've made an investment in, um, more, uh, Telex, uh, FMR 500, which is the same as Electro Voice EV RE-2 wireless microphone systems um, and here mounted in the step van are six of them um, so one two three four and then five six there these are wireless uh, microphones these are all band A's my body packs are band B's and I didn't want to remove these. So I have a full uh, EVRE2 setup in a travel case. I have a couple other brands, wireless mics, that work okay. I haven't found anything that works as good as these do. So I made an investment into, believe it or not, two more um, receivers um, in the Telex. FMR or EVRE2s. I believe the two I bought were actually EVRE2s. And I have only these two uh, Electrovoice or Telex body packs. So I bought one more. Um, so I've been piecemealing this together um, on eBay. That's a little bit cloudy. Um, and then I bought this cable. So instead of a lapel mic, like this, which would plug into the body pack, this is a guitar cord. So it's a quarter inch mono jack plug, excuse me. And right now I'm plugged it into my mixer here where I have a signal out. It says sum out. So it's the combination of everything on the board. Right now the only input we have working is just uh, YouTube and so it's actually broadcasting this out my body pack and in the other room in the barn here I've got two of the telex or actually those are electro voice re2s tuned into the same channel frequency as this telex body pack so let's go in the other room. Adam, Adam, can we go in the other room, please? She's my big helper today. All right, so this is going in the truck. Adam will lead the way. She knows where we're going. Don't you, sweetie? Yeah, Dad, you have a maze of junk around here. So, sorry for the mess in here. This is a pair of speakers I bought at auction. Actually, uh, does very good. I've used these before. I've geeked with these. 
Not this particular pair, but another pair like them. So this is a mixer that I just bought. Oh, here we got low light situation here. So I just bought this mixer a week ago. Yamaha uh, 640. I have another 640 and I have two 860 Yamahas. I love powered mixers. They're very, very useful. Um, I watch uh, the internet hard for these and I bought this thing for a hundred bucks. So here's the two RE2 receivers. Right now I have them both set on a, okay, so yeah, group seven channel three. Group 7, channel 3. They're on the same channel as the body pack. And right now I have one of them in channel 1. So they're both receiving the same signal. Turn off channel 1, turn on channel 2. So it works really well. There's no noise in them. It's real clean. Um, it's a great solution for a, a gig I have coming up here in a couple months. Um, I could actually have two back of house setups with a powered mixer, run as many speakers as you want off of each receiver. We need to talk. We need to talk. So anyway, I thought I would share that. Uh, it, somebody else may find it useful or they might find a use for their uh you know like an, an older wireless microphone or something they're not using anymore and they could turn it into a remote uh signal sender so you can pick it back up and uh, amplify it and plug some more speakers in and um have a good time so with that guys thanks for watching commenting subscribing i hope you found this helpful Hit the like button if you would, please. These videos come absolutely free to you. But hitting the like button is like throwing a penny in my piggy bank. And I'd appreciate the penny. Thanks, guys.